host Kushant, and today I'm gonna share a story from the book called sure. The Day I Stopped mm. Drinking Milk. So mm. let me ask you a question. Have you ever gone to stay at a friend's place and you did not like the accommodations you were given? If so, then hope this story will change your perspective. Mm. So once upon a time, in a remote village in the beautiful lands of Odisha, there, Sudamurti G went there to do some volunteer work to help build a school. But one day, it was raining very heavily and they couldn't get to the place they were staying. So the translator advised them to stay at a small hut nearby. When they arrived there, the man sitting there immediately welcomed them in and asked, tea or coffee? But she did not drink tea or coffee, so she nodded her head in saying no. But then again, the man asked, milk? She did not drink milk regularly either, but she didn't want to be so rude and reject everything this man offered, so she accepted. Then the man went to his wife and told the wife, can I please have one glass of goat's milk? We have a guest at our place and we need to give them something. But the wife got really furious and shouted at the man, we already have a baby that needs the milk. I can't give it to the guest. If she wants fish, I can give fish. If she wants rice and water, I can give rice and water. If she wants tea or coffee, I can give it with a tablespoon of milk. But then the man asked, please, you're a kind woman. Just this one guest, just add some water with the glass of milk and then split it between the baby and Sudamati G. They're building a school for our children. But then the wife with no other choice accepted. Then the translator came back with something he had bought from a little shop nearby. And Sudamati G told the translator to tell the couple that she fasts on this day because the, the couple didn't know that she could understand their language the language that they spoke and she understood it and she felt really bad that she's stealing milk from a baby so she told the translator to tell them that she fasts on wednesdays and then the translator got really confused but he still told it to them and then the translator when they when they left it they thanked the couple for their hospitality the couple felt bad that they couldn't offer them anything but they still felt good that they tried their best. And then the translator asked, nobody fasts on Wednesdays. They fast on Thursdays, Tuesdays, Saturdays, but nobody on Wednesdays. But the, and then Sudamurti replied, Sudamurti G replied with a smile on her face that I fast on Wednesdays for Buddha. <laughs> the moral of the story is, Sometimes the host cannot always accommodate with our wishes. We should be grateful with what the host can give to us and we can't keep asking for more. And that is the day that Sudamurti G stopped drinking milk. Uh, thank you for listening to this and bye. Thank you. Thank you very well read, Krishant. Thanks.